age of leaving school to 18. Um, Micah is four. Yes. Okay, hello. I'm four raising the legal age. Okay, so by raising the legal age to 18, it makes it impossible for students to drop out of school. And um, sure, school can be hard sometimes, but like, really, is that really a reason to drop out? And um, in the long run, it's more important to graduate from high school than to like just go through a little bit of pain. So in some cases, um, people drop out of school because they're being bullied. But if you're being bullied, you can just um, tell an adult or tell an adult or um, just like get help otherwise, or just stand up for yourself. Uh, Liam, um, I think we've all seen that telling the adult not necessarily always helps. In some cases, it makes it worse. You need to even suicide. Plus, you really got to evaluate your uh, telling uh, an adult does help. Not always, yes. Like not telling an adult can always help. But if it gets worse, if it gets like really bad, you can still switch schools. You don't have to drop out completely. I know, but and if you drop out, like if you can switch schools, that doesn't necessarily mean it'll get better. Well, it always doesn't mean you're, you're away from the bully. That's not hey, you know what else is invented? The internet. It was what's invented after the internet. Oh my God. No. And do you know what else? You can still go on the internet when even after you drop out. Guys, just. But my continues. Yeah, it's kind of true. Okay, so if it is cyberbullying, then even after you drop out of school, you still have a phone. Like you're still gonna get messages. School doesn't change anything. Like, There's such thing as blocking messages. Yeah.